Hey guys, my name is Roseanne, otherwise known as the Sack Fitness Fairy. Welcome Eat Like a Champ members. When you have those struggles and when you think, oh, I, I've been eating bad, so I'm just gonna throw the diet out the window or throw my clean eating habits out the window or I haven't been to the gym for several days and I'm just gonna give up on that program, you gotta stop, look at your goal, reevaluate and think that the next meal I can make better the next day I can get to the gym. It's really, really up to you what you do with your fitness and what you do with your healthy living. Whether you were thin once back in the day and you're having problems now and you feel like, oh, I can never get back to that shape or I can never get back to that type of living or healthy living or I used to eat so well, your fate is never sealed. You can always regroup. You can always start living a healthier lifestyle. You can always start eating something better and you can always take a foot back into the gym, start one day at a time. When I think back and I think of a time when I was struggling with my fitness and when I was struggling with eating right, I have to go back to when I was, was balancing my, my, uh, my child's schedule and then my schedule. I put my healthy eating and my healthy lifestyle on the back burner in order to accommodate um, a schedule of just like everybody out there. I'm sure a lot of you out there have trying to juggle family and time and work because believe it or not when you actually live a healthier lifestyle and you get that fitness in, you get the energy, you have positive energy and it helps you get through stressful and harder times. I decided that I was going to just schedule my day. I actually scheduled my workouts as an appointment and I made a commitment to meet those appointments. Was it easy? No. Nope. I mean, I had to take my son to school. I had to take him to soccer practice. I had to do this. But once I made a commitment to get back on track, actually looking at a physical goal on my calendar, it made it it made it made me more accountable with eat like a champ and making those choices to get into the gym or to do to uh, do a workout that'll help you physically get in shape and your body will feel good and you'll be eating better you'll have more energy or please send me an email sackfitnessfairy at gmail.com I'd love to hear from you um, if you have any questions or if there's any way that I can help you with your fitness goals please let me know so if you're gonna to go to the gym and you're gonna to decide to um, get up off the couch and make a commitment to a healthy and fit lifestyle, here's a little tip. You can go ahead and give yourself a one minute test. Um, give yourself a one minute test with push-ups, maybe pull-ups, sit-ups, um, step-ups, um, whatever you can think of. Get about five or six exercises. Test yourself. Do it for one minute. Go as hard as you can. Don't worry, if you only get one, that's fine. And then in three weeks, test yourself again. You'll be amazed. You might be doing five or 10 more of each of those exercises. And that's a little bit of encouragement because if you started today with only one pull-up and in three weeks you have 10 or six in your belt, you're gonna feel fantastic.